Yeah, we just got a 2410 software upgrade, which enables us to do SLR, or SATCOM launch and recovery, coupled with ATLC or auto takeoff and land. This is gonna enable MQ-9s to take off and land pretty much anywhere in the world as long as we fall under the sat footprint, satellite footprint. So instead of having a typical DFE or dynamic force employment, bringing maintainers all over the, the world, uh, tw or 30 to 40 maintainers at a time, we can use a small ACE team or Agile Combat Employment team of six maintainers to go to a four location. The MQ-9 could then land there, land, load, refuel, and then relaunch from there via SATCOM and then the crews uh, located in the CONUS would be able to fly all over the place. So very different from the traditional line of sight only re launch and recovery that we've been used to. We are using our PAX terminal to uh, launch a uh, MQ-9 aircraft out of the airport here. So the cool thing about the PAX terminal is it's a lightweight portable unit that allows us to uh, be a lot more mobile with our entire system here. So what the terminal the terminal allows us to directly connect to an aircraft and then turn on the satellite KU settings of that aircraft. And then from there, we are able to connect with a GCS on our home station here without using the local C-band antenna. So we are only using our satellite frequencies. So we've been testing it here in Fargo, flying out of our building here with our own GCS. But this capability allows us to do this in any sort of deployed location, anywhere where there's satellite access. So basically anywhere worldwide, we could hook up to this plane taxi it over to the runway spot and then the plane will actually use automatic takeoff and landing control and take off into the air itself. SLR and ATLC in the 2410 is huge for the entire enterprise because the current environment that we live in, having that ability to island hop or go to these small contingency locations and be able to land as opposed to having a large base set up, we're able to stop for a very brief time and then fly to a different location. So that's our PAC system, which is a portable aircraft control station. That is how we control the aircraft as a crew chief and has the ability to hand off to the air crew wherever they are. Good example of the hooligan way of how we're uh, on the cutting edge of things and ahead of the curve with the new technology that's coming out.